Thursday Thoughts, Paradigm 3, Week 1, and the paradigm this month is that I will acknowledge every behavior and experience has a positive intention. So what do I mean by that? Some examples that I was just quickly brainstorming on is say you're trying to lose weight, but you decide to go out on a Friday frenzy of binge eating and or drinking and then you feel like shit after it. Instead of looking at yourself or judging yourself as a failure or a person that you know could have done better, instead the positive intention behind that behavior or that experience in which you allowed yourself to feel is it's an opportunity to realize that you were just desiring to feel something more. Something was not literally full within you that you were using a substance to help fill that part of you. Okay. Um, another example is say you're going through a really bad breakup. Yes. It's heartbreaking. It sucks. A lot of judgment, a lot of check-ins, a lot of heartache, and sad times come with that. But the positive intention behind when relationships end or go through a rough patch is the positive intention within that is to allow you to get really clear or to be able to experience a greater sense of happiness, a sense of love and belonging or safety in which you know to be true for yourself. And how cool is that? Um, The third example that I thought of is, say you get hard feedback or criticism at work and it really chaps your ass, right? Just pisses you off. The way in which you choose to react to that, there's a positive intention that it's keeping you It's an opportunity or it's an occurrence that is allowing you to stay in check with what your, you, your personal core values are and what's important to you. And that is also kind of cool. So for me personally, uh, the two I thought of this week are my foot pain. That's the first one. And the positive intention behind being physically exhausted and kind of irritated with how weak my body is. And by weak, I mean I've taught 11 classes in the last five days. So I'm not necessarily weak, but the positive intention behind that is it's going to force me to slow down and take care of myself. Cool, right? Um, and then hard criticism. Uh, I've got some hard feedback uh, at Cycle Bar and... Um, I've been given the opportunity to just really radically understand that I'm an acquired taste and not everyone is going to like me and that's okay because that is the way it should be. If I keep trying to live life by pleasing everyone, every shape, everything, everywhere I am, I'm going to be in the hole real, real fast. So. Just continually checking in with the understanding as we go through the month of March of knowing and interpreting and applying the concept of, I will acknowledge that every behavior or experience has a positive intention. So what does that mean for you? Enjoy your weekend.